Hello everyone, welcome again to my channel Xenonetic. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can install the Google Chrome browser on your Google TV or Android TV based device. This is going to be a quick tutorial on how to do this, so stay tuned. Before we get started, I just want to inform you, this video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. If you find any value in this video, which you will, please smash that like button and hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. So let's get started. So yeah, with the Google Chrome browser, you can actually visit any website you want. Uh, unfortunately, uh, the Google TV Chromecast 4K and other Android-based devices does not come with a built-in web browser. With this tutorial you can actually install one and yeah it's going to be the google chrome itself and yeah it's going to work good so stay tuned uh first things first we're going to download a few things we're going to go over apps and we're going to search uh for site load right here i'm going to use my phone as a remote i'm going to type in site load and oh, hit enter And it's just going to be the first one we're going to download. It is a bit outdated, but that doesn't matter. Just hit install, let it do its magic, and let it load up. And we don't need to open it up for now. What we're going to do is we're going to search for another app, and that's going to be the app called Downloader. Not Downloader, Downloader. So yeah, this, is, this application, the Google Chrome browser, is handy for... If you want to visit any website or any web-based... Uh, uh, interface you'll have the option to it so yeah you can think out of the box what you can do with it some people li like it so this it has been requested a few times in the past so okay download is also installed we don't need to open it up yet we're gonna go to the home settings and we're gonna go to the settings gear at the right corner right there we're gonna click on the settings gear and then we're gonna go down all the way to system when you're in system, you're going to swipe right. Then when you click uh, down once, swipe right, go all the way down until you see Android TV OS built in. You're going to click on it many times until you see one step away of developer. And now you're a developer. You're just going to click on OK on the remote control. Now you're going to swipe left again and you're going to go all the way down until you see developer option. This is new. So now you're also a developer and we're actually done here for now next step is to go back home and go to our app section and go all the way right see all and go to the downloader application and we're going to hit allow we're going to hit ok ok so this is the downloader application if you're not familiar with this with this you can actually uh, make codes to directly download any link you want they have their own website for it so it comes pretty handy uh, in this case we're just going to type in a link that I will leave in the description and with this we'll get the application we want that's going to be this link right here you can also just pause the video and type it over uh, but this is the link and with this again this download application is something like a web browser but it's only for downloads uh, so yeah with this link we'll go to the next step hit go and it's gonna load here and you're gonna come to this link right here which is not I'm just gonna hit back again because I'm gonna change the link and I'm just gonna remove everything and this is the right link enter it's still the same good just wanted to double check that so we're gonna go down and we're gonna go to latest version and go down again and there you have the download button right there click on it let it download And this is a good moment for you to smash that like button and hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. Also, any feedback is welcome. Let me know how I do. If you have any tips for me, please let me know. Almost finishing up here. 
Okay, and now we can hit the install. And it's going to probably ask you uh, to uh, approve unknown sources, which will be fine. Yeah, here. You, uh, you'll get this notification here. You just press OK on settings. And go to downloader. And hit install in this case. I've already had it, so just hit install. And then it will be installed, as you can see right here. Now we can go back to the home section and uh, we can go to all the apps, side load launcher, open that up, hit OK right here. And then you have the Chrome application. Click OK. There you have it. It's going to probably ask you to uh, log in if you want to log in or it's already pre logged in. But after that, this is it. You're in the web based Chrome browser on your Google TV for K or any other Android TV like Philips, Sony, etc. So that's it folks. It was a pretty easy tutorial on how to do this. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button and hit that subscribe button. If you have any feedback for me, let me know. And also if it didn't work for you, let me know because I will help you fix this. Thank you all for watching and goodbye.